Hey yo, Carbon Mercury here. Welcome to a video I'm doing on the Eternal Cylinder. See that thing right there? That is the cylinder that is Eternal. It's been a while since I've recorded a video. I'm not dead, obviously. I've just been more focusing on music and... Once upon a time, in the age of the Eternal Cylinder, there lived a family of... I guess we'll let this guy take it from here. The Trebum. Trebum are not the strongest, nor the fastest, and they do not have sharp teeth. They would make easy prey for the terrible force that came to their planet. But Trebum are loyal and resourceful and very, very stubborn. It is with such a Trebum that our story begins. One clever little creature born into a cruel world who would be instrumental in bringing prosperity to its kind. Okay, the graphics look pretty nice. But yeah, I signed up for this beta. I honestly want to say, I think it's, it was like three years ago, but it was probably about two. I didn't check. I thought maybe that it wasn't gonna happen or they forgot about it or whatever. But here it is. I got an email today with my beta key. You can see the eternal cylinder just chasing that man down. We are going to learn about this game together. As far as I know, it might be... Run, something inside him said. Run. Ooh. It might be the... Um, spiritual successor to uh, Spore, a game that I never played, but I heard great things about I mean, like, the concept sounded amazing. I don't know how the execution of the game actually was. But so far, this seems a lot better than I expected. It looks beautiful. Controls decently well. Okay, I think the, yeah, that cylinder be coming for us. We gotta get out of here. They want us to know that. So I wasn't controlling that camera. The great crushing it thing, stopped. the great cylinder had stopped. Perhaps it was safe here for a little while. How quickly it learned to use its legs and its trunk. But these things were not so much learned as they were remembered. Perhaps, the little Trebum thought, they were a gift from the strange voice it heard in its mind. That too was a kind of memory. Yeah, look at this. It looks really nice. Uh, now how the hell do we get out of here? What is this? Kind of XP. Choose materials you've collected. Let's see. I think I just ate that. Just when it was starting to get used to its legs, oh, the food from okay. the jumping creature gave it new ones. So that right dude. Substance is a catalyst. Not that dude, but. can transform and adapt to many challenges. That uh, little grasshopper thing dropped that egg and then I ate it and now I so yeah let's see what happens when I consume this man I don't think it I don't really know okay take a second try this out Oh, maybe those aren't things that I can actually evolve from. They're just like materials that I need to use for whatever. Yeah, okay, I'm trying this thing. Didn't seem to do much. It would appear that is giving me health, maybe? Let's try it again. 
Okay, I'm eating. Yeah, that was just a heal. Let's try this one. And then that one gave me... Oh. Storage body allows them to store a larger number of objects collected via the trunk. See, I don't know if the game is like... Oh, that wasn't good. Oh, <laughs> yeah, I'm just going to fix that. It just changed uh, screen resolution for whatever reason. Okay, there we go. That was weird. But yeah, I don't know if the game's like a Metroidvania where we want to get certain things to progress or if it's more of an open world thing where we kind of create our own species and choose our own kind of the path was drawn to a bright light or perhaps to the creature next to it okay well let's go where the thing tells us. I kind of want to screw with those guys, but maybe not. We'll, we'll do what the game wants us to do right now. But yeah, it definitely looks really nice. It's a little framey, but that's... This is the beta version. I don't really... It's already, like, surpassed my expectations. Does this thing roll? No. Nope. Let's take this thing for fodder. I do have like a gauge on the left. I don't know what it does. Let's try eating this thing again. Just when it was starting to get used to its legs, the food from the jumping creature gave it new ones. With the right substance as a catalyst, a trebum can transform and adapt to many challenges. A little bit delayed. Okay, I think that was... I'm basically Kirby, if you haven't noticed. But I'm trying to see if that gauge on the left there... Once it fills up, do I, like, evolve again? I just ate everything in my inventory. I didn't move at all. Okay, where's this thing want me to go? Except for the grass growing on the old one's head. They oh. were very much alike. Okay, we know how I... Changed the video there. I kind of... I think I clicked out of frame. Come here. So we want to know what this does. Surrounded by this light, the Trebum knew things it had not known before. It knew the older Trebum had carried this light for a long, long time. And it knew that now that responsibility had passed to the next generation. Yes, this young Trebum had to carry the light to those great towers in the distance. It could have stayed here to learn many old things, but the cylinder would not allow it. Okay, that's kind of what I figured. The cylinder is just going to keep pushing us to the next section. Run, the inner voice said. Which is Run. good because the I. The towers would not stop the cylinder unless they were activated. Might just get stuck there forever screwing around trying to figure stuff out. Oh, for fuck's sakes. I didn't mean to. Stop the game. Hold on. Apply. Okay. 
I have it in window and I'm not used to windows, so I keep like kicking clicking out of the The Trebom had to step on the symbol or the cylinder would not be stopped. Screen and then changing the resolution. But that's fine, that's my own problem. Do I just go through here? I kind of didn't pay enough attention to that guy, but let's see what happens when the cylinder hits this thing. The voice inside the Trebum's memories assured it that while the tower stood, the Trebum would be safe. The power of the eternal cylinder was contained for now. This relative tranquility gave the Trebum a chance to think about its family. Trebum are not meant to live alone, so where were the others? That thing is fucking pretty. Jesus. Okay, super close up is not that amazing, but still, I love the, the glitter. Purple. I see if it'll can, like, sneak up on it or something. Maybe we can crush its shell or something like that later. We get claws, I don't know. Our young friend had found an egg. A trebum egg with one of his siblings inside. The egg had been abandoned, but it could still be made to hatch. All that was needed was a source of heat. That thing looks hot. Do I want to shoot it in there or do I just hold it by? Okay, I guess it just went right through. That's fine. Okay, his name's Wooball. Enter name, whatever. I'll just leave that name for now. Okay, so we have a new offspring of some sorts. Definitely looks really cozy in there. On this. How does it just follow me? Yeah, it definitely has survival elements. I'm just not sure what the gauges do. It's one gauge that I have to be in water for a little bit to get it back. That sounds scary. Okay, where to go? A Trevum is too young to swim across. Watch for the beams of light that come from activated towers. They will point you to objectives or areas of interest. It was hard for the Trevum to know what to do or where to go. I just want to see but if this refills my water. Yeah, it does. This was not the right way. To find your path, it said. You must follow the beam of light that emanates from the tip of the tower. Oh my god, that thing was a fucking waters trap. Where the old things dwell. Kind of want to. Oh no. I'm just, I'm just gonna stay away from that. Jesus, look at these. Is that thing chasing me down? I do enjoy the ball rolling. Okay, you're still with me. Okay, let's try eating some food. 
So I see that thing that's on six gave us back some more like water. This thing. I don't know what that does. Okay, maybe. Because they have symbols in the top right. And I'm assuming the symbol that kind of looks like a mushroom that's on the pear looking thing right now is the thing that makes us evolve. I didn't mean to eat the health one. Could be wrong, but there is a new biome over there. Wait, let's go see if the light that we need to follow. Is that it? No. Okay, there it goes over there. I think. Very is nice. Okay, let's try this thing. Seven. Not really sure how we evolve yet. It just happens when we need meet new species, maybe, and we eat them. What is this? I'm assuming it's bad. It's a prickly boy. That just a giant sea snake. Nothing's cute. I really thought that was a cave entrance, but it wasn't. stuff. Where'd the beam go? I think the beam's leading to that guy. Oh god. Run! Run! Let's go over here for a second. Stop rolling. I don't know that our offspring came with us. Okay, let's consume uh, our food. Maybe it's the energy thing that gives us Who knows, we'll figure it out eventually. There was like a little mini guide that came with the Finding another trickum was a cause for joy, but this new friend was not well. Oh no. Deep inside the memories it had inherited, the trebum found the answer. To recover, its friend needed a very specific substance which appeared as glittering clusters of crystal dust. Okay, what if this it, dust which I was just not got. natural. Only a great Trebum could create it. And so it was on the achievements of previous generations that the newborn Trebum would have to rely. Luckily, it seemed a wise and powerful Trebum had passed through here some time ago. More dust. Dust is very nice looking.
Rip. Normally I don't have it windowed, but I do right now because it was just the easy way to do things. Um, okay, so we talked to the dude, we gave him his dust. A new family member joins the group. Okay, I'll let him keep his name. How does if I jump in here? Do I just like get healed or something? Okay, my stats, they did not do anything. Unless that's just like where we put our eggs when we find them. Check out these dudes. They don't seem happy with me. Thought maybe I could like it's mo it's freaking boo. Okay, to not work. I thought maybe I could, like, get the slime from them or something. What's this? This door had been built okay. for Trevor. It gave them hope that in this large and dangerous world, some places had been made for them. Okay. So if we had- we had three dudes so we can enter this area. It's like a little dungeon or whatever. Honk you. It's a switch. Okay. Still can't really. Tell you for sure if this is. It's nice. Like a Metroidvania. Or if it's. It's your average survival game. That's definitely a, not really average because it's already pretty sweet and unlike other things I've seen before. The camera could use some work, but that might just be because I'm using a mouse and it's supposed to be a controller. I could be wrong about that. I did see the thing, I'm just, I'm looking around before we bother with it. Okay, now I want to switch this guy because he has more storage. Okay, let's just try this thing. Somehow this ancient statue transferred knowledge to the Trevor. Organic cube, a rare organic growth found near certain ancient Trevum structures, most likely artificial in origin. Weird. Yeah, at least it didn't tell me as much as I thought it was going to. Okay, so we did that. It was as if a memory had been stored inside it, waiting for someone to absorb it. So let's try to go through as here. As soon as this knowledge okay, no. had entered their minds, the Trebum realized that there was a great library of information hidden away in the web of their memories. But why was the knowledge of a specific ingredient placed here in this Trebum made of stone? Dude. Shoot water. Well, that's what I wanted to do. Give me that 
back. Just gathering stuff. Um, switch to this dude. Didn't mean to press that. I would like the cube. Okay, let's try this cube out and see if it makes us evolve or something. Uh, seven, six. Oh yeah, he likes that. Okay, we are now cuboid. I did not read that before I said cuboid. I just... Okay, anyways. Allows... Shit, I didn't read it. We're screwed now. So now we can... Wait, how come my carrying capacity went down? Weird. Okay, uh, switch. This guy. Eat some of this stuff. Oops, let me need all that. Eat the cube. See if it transforms this dude to a cube. Yes, it does. Also, enter specific openings in certain places and unlocks ancient mechanisms. I like how this wants us to shoot water about. Oh, we did it. Okay, well, let's go back. I don't know why my inventory got smaller though. I know I switched people, but when I want cuboid. I lowered my inventory. Okay, well, we can at least say that it has Metroidvania elements. Oh, the Elder. Inside the cave, Petrebum found a living Elder. It had been waiting in this chamber for a long, long time. The elder told them it was happy to see some friends before the cylinder came. <laughs> it said, you are young, so you never knew the time when our people could shapeshift at will. We, Trebum, are inheritors of a vast tree of abilities. Abilities passed on to all future Trebum. But this power is being taken away. Beware the servants of the Cylinder. They will seek to hurt you at every opportunity. And they have the power to rob you of your abilities. But if you persevere, one day you will find a way to protect yourselves from their evil light. Farewell, my brave friends. I fear I am too old and tired to join you. May you find a way to prosper in this time of struggles. Alrighty. So wait, so if we stand in water oh no. I'm still trying to figure out how to shoot water. Hold on, I wanna know. Is it only this dude that can do it? For whatever reason, the cube thing is flashing. Maybe he wants that one to also eat a cube? I don't know. Let's get out of here. I don't know if this will take us back to where we were. It was not easy to leave the cave, but the Elder had urged them to go forward. Suddenly, they felt the weight of their many tasks. To find their Trebum siblings. To restore the powers their people had lost. 
and it all seemed a little daunting. But even when they are afraid, Trebum are stubborn. Well, I think I'm going to call the video there. Seems like a good place. And if we oh. make another run, we'll just continue on. See what else we can explore. Try finding the light. But yeah. Thank you so much for watching. Subscribe, comment if you want to see more in the future. I haven't really said gotten a chance to record videos. It's more because I've switched my focus more to music. Which I always was focused on, but now it's more I'm trying to be more prominent. And yeah, just comment, just like, give me some feedback, and I will see you next time. Have a very lovely evening, and good night.